Hey everybody, Dwayne from DwayneKilborn.com here again with another unboxing. Uh, this time, uh, let's see if I can lift this thing. I got my trusty order in from uh, good old Cellucor. Uh, this is apparently about 12 pounds, so if I just leave it in there, I'm actually still get a good workout. But uh, nonetheless, I have, if I can find it, my uh, blade, and we'll get this thing opened up. Here we are, right here. Okay, so order the few things this time around. We'll try and get things in order as we get close to the uh, closer and closer to summertime. Looks good. Okay, I got a little package slip here. Bubble wrap. Here's what I have. My favorite must have M5 fruit punch. Uh, M5 2 and 1 fruit punch. Uh, like I said before, both this and the cherry limeade both uh, have the same ingredients inside. For me, I just like the fruit punch a little bit better. It works really well. That's the first thing first. Secondly, I have R3. Post-workout, I use it um, in conjunction with um, with my recovery process. Definitely, I have my protein, of course, but that's an anti-inflammatory defense matrix, that sort of thing. And then I have my favorite BCA. Um, I was going to order some of the Tropical uh, Punch. Um, however, the watermelon is my favorite. And then, of course, Tropical Punch. I'll probably get that next time. And definitely use this in the middle of my workout. I typically do two muscle groups at a time. After my first muscle group has been completed, I'll take that and uh, also add in some creatine, which is this. Now, if you've noticed on there, when they first came out with the core creatine product, it's uh, just pure creatine, uh, that sort of thing, but it's... Uh, unflavored and it took me a little while to get used to the unflavored because it has a slight uh, even though it's unflavored it's a different type of beast however it came out with two flavors I believe it's blue raspberry and this is a green apple or granny granny smith apple so uh, I'm gonna try it out actually I'm not sure how I'm gonna do this just yet and I'll actually try it out tonight because I'm gonna go be heading to the gym here in a little while but one of the th one of my thoughts happens to be, well, if I'm having watermelon, should I mix this, or if I bought the blueberry, with it? Or, because that's what I typically do, I take the unflavored, and then I take the BCA, one scoop each, put it in basically a full glass of, or a smart shake, full of water, you're looking at about 20 ounces, maybe 16, that sort of thing, and it tastes just fine. But this is apple, in this case, this is watermelon. So, curious how it's gonna work out. Um, I, if I had the lemon lime with a tropical punch, I don't know if the apple would work right, uh, or if I should just take one by itself, pound it down, and immediately follow it up with the other one. So kind of curious because I'm surprised they didn't link up the flavors to match up with the BCAs, but not everyone takes it together, so we'll see what happens. So keep that in mind. And then I actually got a uh, four pound. This is I kind of curious how it was this is the cookies and cream so I have four pounds of cookies and cream and uh, definitely I put this to good use this is the anytime core whey protein and ooh, actually wait oh another BCA so I guess I have two BCAs in here which is fine um, I sometimes take BCAs early in the day as well and I have the assurance here um, Say core. That says results matter. So I have two of those, and definitely love to wear my soy core gear. As you see here, I have my Super HD shirt that I um, got back when they had the release of the Super HD at the I think it was from the the Fed Expo in LA. 
and that was in 2012. So I always like to collect some good shirts. I like to wear either Under Armour if I'm wearing just regular tough gear, fitness related gear, or I'll wear Sunny Core gear because I'm very uh, much a fan of theirs. And of course, once in a while, because you you also know I'm a big Foursquare fan, I have a few Foursquare related shirts. But other than that. I've uh, retired the Muscle Farm shirt. If anyone wants a Muscle Farm shirt, I have a large, I think it's a large, uh, let me know if you're a fan of Muscle Farm. Um, I really don't know much about their products, nothing against them or for them, I just love Cycor. So if you happen to um, want that shirt, tweet me, at Dwayne Kilborn. But for me, I'm going with the best of the best, which is Cycor. So that's that. Um, everything came in that I can see, everything looks good. Anxious to try it out and I'd like to hear what your your uh, routine is when it comes to supplementation. Of course you want to start in the kitchen so I would recommend that. I need to recommend that to myself as well. I've been eating okay but not great so uh, let me know if you have any eating recommendations and we'll go from there. But again I have some some M5, I have some BCAs, some creatine, R3 and some protein and some good shirts. And that's that. So follow me at, uh, on Twitter. Shoot me a tweet at Dwayne Kilborn. Uh, of course, you can connect with me over on Facebook. It's uh, facebook.com slash fitnessfrenzydwayne. And last but not least, my fitness blog, fitness.dwaynekilborn.com. I promise there will be some more posts coming very soon. Working on those in the coming days. So fingers crossed on that, and I will speak with you soon. You guys have a great one, and I'm off to the gym.